एवरीवन वेलकम टू अवर मेरा नॉलेज चैनल दिस इज अवर सैलत बादशाह दिस इज दिस वीडियो इज आल्सो ए कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ डेहाटसू जनरेटर दी का वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल ट्राई टू शो हाउ टू रिमूव शेल बियरिंग फ्रॉम द क्रैंक पिन असेंबली सो लेट्स गो इन साइड द वीडियो सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू रिमूव द शेल बियरिंग फ्रॉम द बियरिंग असेंबली so this is your uh, lower shell lower bearing part so i am going to remove it so there will be a pin which uh, locks the bearing so that is where you need to remove the locking pin out so how we need to remove you can even push by hand and press from top it will come easily if not use a very light wooden pallet and hit on top of it so i'll use a wooden pallet and do not use any metal thing it may damage your bearing so just hit over the bearing very slowly and try to push from hand use your hand this is your locking assembly which locks in the body groove so that is out already so now i can push the bearing by hand also so you can see yeah you can see this is your uh, locking thing so now i am trying to push by hand if not you can use your wooden pallet so very little tap will remove the bearing out so always uh, uh, handle the bearing very carefully you can see the bearing and uh, once you remove the bearing wipe it nicely and you have to keep uh, it secured on a clean cloth in a clean cloth and you have to number the bearing so this bearing is uh, whatever unit whichever unit you are removing so remove from that uh, particular bearing you have to mark it as a number so that i don't get uh, confused when boxing back so i remove it from um, number 2 unit so i write number as number 2 unit and it's a bottom shell bearing okay that's all so next is i have to keep it secured and then i open the top shell bearing top shell bearing also the same way it have a locking pin and you can see the locking pin over here this is your bearing path oil flow path in between the groove between the groove and uh, you can see the difference between bottom and top bottom will be having a different oil groove and uh, top will have a different oil groove so this oil groove path should be free of any kind of obstacles so these are the two difference so you cannot uh, mix it top to bottom or bottom to top again same way just use a wooden pallet hit it very slowly so that the bearing will come out yeah that's all the bearing is already out so the reason why you use some wooden pallet is it don't damage the bearing this bearing have a very uh, thin thin coat so if you use uh, metal it may damage the bearing coatings and it may even damage the bearing body also so again uh, this is for number 2 unit top shell bearing so both i keep it uh, marked and i secure it in separate place so i have to cover it with the uh, clean rags clean cloth and i have to keep it safely so that's all so after uh, watching this video you must have got some idea about uh, how to uh, remove a, a shell bearing from crank pin assembly bearing assembly so in my next video i'll try to show how to take a quality check for crank pin bearing so as i always say keep uh, sharing our channel subscribe our channel uh, share our channel with your friends groups and everyone so that our uh, channel will grow globally so 
thanks for watching if you have any doubt uh, you just uh, put in comment box definitely i reply you if i am at sea i'll be in whatsapp so whatever doubt you have you can uh, post in whatsapp as possible i'll try to clarify the doubts keep supporting thanks for watching